Hello, and welcome to this short tutorial video on backing up Wonderware System Platform components. Prior to any upgrade or migration, it's always a good idea to back up the components of the system of the System Platform Galaxy. Those components are the Galaxy repository, the historian, and the information server. Wonderware provides you with a suite of tools to accomplish this task. This video will instruct you in the use of those tools. With that, let's begin. In this video, we'll be backing up systems that are part of our virtual environment. This virtual environment is composed of an ESXi, a VMware ESXi hypervisor. Let's begin with the GR node. To begin, prior to backing up the software, let's first verify that our system is working as it should. To facilitate this, the very first thing I do is I open up the IDE to make sure I can connect to the Galaxy and that all of my objects are functioning or doesn't they don't show me any errors. Looking at my objects, I don't see anything that leads me to have any type of concern, any configuration issues or any configuration problems. The next thing I do is I will open up my object viewer and open a watch window that I created to let me know the status of the system at a glance. I can see that my object servers are ready. My redundant object servers are good to go. I'm receiving data. My systems are communicating and my data, uh, my objects have data. So at a glance, I can say that my Galaxy is functioning as it should. So I simply exit. And now, now that I verify that everything is good to go, I'm going to do a Galaxy export. So I come up here to, to the Galaxy menu option, come down to export, and I'm going to say export all objects going to put it in a location I can easily find it. I have a backups directory. I have an export file already there. I'll just change the date. And click on and click save. At this point it's going through an export process where it's going to export all the objects um, into a AAPKG file, compressed file. And this is good, and just in case you have to do an upgrade or a migration, this will help in, in case that there is a, um, a corruption of objects or uh, something happens uh, in the meantime. Now, depending on how fast your system is, this could take a few minutes or it can take a little while. Once the export has completed successfully, we can close the dialog box and we can close the IDE. The next step is to complete a uh, Galaxy backup using the System Management Console. We go to Start, All Programs, navigate to Wonderware, and navigate to System Management Console. That'll bring up the interface. And once in the interface, we select the Galaxy Database Manager on the left and we select our running Galaxy on the right and then we right click and select backup. We acknowledge the informational message by clicking yes. We select the folder where we want our backup to be stored. We name it appropriately. Save it. In this case I'm going to replace the one that I already have. Click yes. And that begins the backup process. Depending on how fast our system is, it can take a few minutes or it can take a little while. Once the backup is complete, then all we have to do is close the dialog box and we can ex exit out of the SMC 
And that will conclude the backup of the Galaxy repository using the SMC backup utility and a Galaxy export of all objects.